The third decade of the 21st century has begun and the environmental challenges we have ahead of us, set out in the UN 2030 Agenda for Sustainable Development, are many. This global plan of action adopted in 2015 puts forward specific measures to achieve a world that is fairer, more prosperous, and more respectful of the environment within 10 years. In this regard, the UN itself warns that we are running late, and the question now is whether we still have time to save the planet. Our environment faces several problems, and many of these seem to be worsening with time, bringing us into a time of a true environmental crisis. It is therefore becoming increasingly important to raise awareness of the existence of these issues, as well as what can be done to reduce their negative impact. In this video, we have compiled the list of the top 10 main global environmental problems which the United Nations says we need to resolve. Number 10. Public Health Issues There are various ethical dilemmas faced by the healthcare sectors, especially at times of pandemics and health emergencies. The current environmental problems pose a lot of risks to the health of humans and animals. Dirty water is the biggest health risk in the world and poses a threat to the quality of life and public health. According to World Counts, every year nearly 1 million people die from water-related diseases. Most of them are children. Runoff to rivers carries with it toxins, chemicals, and disease-carrying organisms. Pollutants cause respiratory diseases like asthma and cardiac vascular problems. High temperatures encourage the spread of infectious diseases like dengue. There is a need for changes to be made in the public policies and health policies so that the public health institutions are more prepared to deal with emergencies such as the one created by the COVID-19 pandemic. Number 9. Acid Rain Acid rain occurs due to the presence of certain pollutants in the atmosphere. Acid rain can be caused due to combustion of fossil fuels or erupting volcanoes or rotting vegetation, which releases sulfur dioxide and nitrogen oxide into the atmosphere. Acid rain is a known environmental problem that can have a serious effect on human health, wildlife, and aquatic species. Acid rain has also been shown to have adverse impacts on forests, freshwaters, and soils, killing insect and aquatic life forms, causing the paint to peel. Corrosion of steel structures, such as bridges and weathering of stone buildings and statues, as well as having impacts on human health. Number 8. Ozone Layer Depletion The ozone layer is an invisible barrier of protection that wraps around the world, shielding humans from the sun's damaging radiation. Pollution from chlorine and bromide present in chlorofluorocarbons is blamed for the depletion of the atmosphere's protective ozone layer, CFCs. When these poisonous chemicals reach the high atmosphere, they cause a hole in the ozone layer, the largest of which is located above Antarctica. CFC are prohibited in a wide range of businesses and consumer products. The ozone layer is valuable because it protects the world from damaging ultraviolet rays. This is one of the most serious environmental problems of the day. Number 7. Deforestation our forests are natural carbon dioxide sinks that also provide fresh oxygen and aid in temperature and rainfall regulation. Currently, forests occupy 30% of the area, but every year, tree cover is lost, equating to the entire country of Panama, due to the expanding population demand for more food, shelter, and fabric. Deforestation simply refers to the removal of green cover in order to make land available for residential, industrial, or commercial use. The surplus carbon is stored in the plant, helping it to grow. When trees are cut down and burned or allowed to rot, their stored carbon is released into the air as carbon dioxide. And this is how deforestation and forest degradation contribute to global warming. Number 6. Loss of Biodiversity Human activity is causing the extinction of species and habitats, as well as the loss of biodiversity. Ecosystems that have taken millions of years to perfect are in trouble when any species population is decimated. The balance of natural processes such as pollination is critical to the existence of the ecosystem and human activity threatens it. Another example is the destruction of coral reefs in the world's oceans which support a diverse range of marine life. Biodiversity loss can have significant direct human health impacts if ecosystem services are no longer adequate to meet social needs. Indirectly, changes in ecosystem services affect livelihoods, income, local migration, and, on occasion, may even cause or exacerbate political conflict. Number 5. Ocean Acidification 
Ocean acidification is the ongoing decrease in the pH value of the Earth's oceans, caused by the uptake of carbon dioxide from the atmosphere. The main cause of ocean acidification is the burning of fossil fuels. Ocean acidification is one of several effects of climate change on oceans. Ocean acidity has increased by the last 250 years, but by 2100, it may shoot up by 150%. The main impact is on shellfish and plankton in the same way as human osteoporosis. Ocean acidification can also modify the abundance and chemical composition of harmful algal blooms in such a way that shellfish toxicity increases, and therefore, human health is negatively affected. Number 4. Waste Disposal Waste disposal has significant environmental consequences and can lead to catastrophic difficulties. Overconsumption of resources and the production of plastics are causing a global waste disposal dilemma. Developed countries are infamous for producing an excessive amount of waste or junk and dumping it in the oceans, while less developed countries are notorious for producing an insufficient amount of waste or garbage. The disposal of nuclear waste poses significant health risks. Plastic, fast food, packaging, and low-cost electronic waste endanger human health. Some garbage will ultimately decay, but not all, and in the process it may smell or produce explosive methane gas, which contributes to the greenhouse effect. Leachate formed as garbage decomposes has the potential to pollute the environment. As a result, waste disposal is one of the most serious current environmental issues. Number 3. Pollution There are seven major categories of pollution. Air, water, soil, noise, radioactive, light, and thermal, and they are the principal reasons that have a wide range of effects on our environment. All of these types of pollution are interconnected and have an impact on one another. Therefore, we need to tackle all of them together. Pollution of the air, water, and soil takes millions of years to recover from. The most significant pollutants are those emitted by industry and motor vehicles. Toxins that cause pollution include heavy metals, nitrates, and plastic. While oil spills, acid rain, and urban runoff cause water pollution, air pollution is caused by various gases and toxins released by industries and factories, as well as the combustion of fossil fuels. Soil pollution is primarily caused by industrial waste, which deprives soil of essential nutrients. Number 2. Global Warming Since the Industrial Revolution, the global annual temperature has increased in total by a little more than 1 degree Celsius. Between 1880, the year that accurate recordkeeping began, and 1980, it rose on average by 0.07 degrees Celsius every 10 years. Since 1981, however, the rate of increase has more than doubled. Global warming leads to rising temperatures of the oceans and the Earth's surface causing natural disasters that include flooding, melting of polar ice caps, rise in sea levels, and also unnatural patterns of precipitation such as flash floods, hurricanes, wildfires, drought, excessive snow or desertification. In 2015, for example, scientists concluded that a lengthy drought in California, the state's worst water shortage in 1,200 years, had been intensified by 15 to 20 percent by global warming. They also said the odds of similar droughts happening in the future had roughly doubled over the past century. Number 1. Overpopulation Overpopulation is major issue humanity facing in the 21st century. Fewer than 800 million people populated the Earth in the mid-18th century. Today, barely 250 years later, we are more than 7.7 billion and will continue growing until 2050 by at least another 2 billion. Taking into account the fact that human beings appeared on Earth more than 4 million years ago, what happened in our recent history for the number of inhabitants on the planet to start multiplying exponentially. The tipping point was generally accepted to be the Industrial Revolution, but there are many smaller revolutions that contributed to population takeoff which have brought the planet to its current dangerous overpopulation. Revolutions that are medical, technological, agricultural, financial, transport, and demographical in nature, among others.